<laughs> so, yes, anthropoid pelvis, right. And um, so our babies won't necessarily be straight um, looking back at our backs. A lot of times, like I said, they'll be either on the left or they'll be on the right. And that's because we have these hips that kind of flare out. Now, many, many cases, you'll find um, that your baby or ba our babies tend to hang out on the right side, especially if you're right handed, right? And the reason for this is babies like to go to where there's more space. It's not because babies like it per se on the right, it's because they tend to have more space on the right if you're right handed. And the reason for that is if you're right handed, you tend to lean to the left. You lean a lot to the left. You probably carry your purse on the left. You're carrying groceries, you're carrying bags. If you're standing and you're working, you're leaning to the left. And all of that leaning to the left constricts and narrows the space on the left side of your body. And you can talk to a chiropractor about this. I definitely lift up chiropractors. They are excellent for helping to adjust hips and optimize birthing space for babies. And we're gonna talk about that in a little bit more detail. But ultimately, um, babies go to where there is the most space, right? And um, in most cases, like I said, if you're right-handed, that's going to be on the right side of your body. And so <clears throat> the reason why um, it's important to identify that is because uh, an optimal birthing position for your baby actually is on the left side. It's actually on the left side. 